14-week-old Jet isn't your typical member of the fire crew, but this purebred border collie is very much part of the team. Go into our office, eh? We'll go into our office. The Christchurch Airport has called on the help of this canine for one job, but it's one job that's causing major issues for aircrafts. Scaring birds away from the runway to avoid this sort of thing, that's um, small birds, probably starling type birds overseas, but all around the aircraft and ready to be ingested into the engine there. Birds hanging around the tarmac are a multi-billion dollar problem for aviation worldwide. The Christchurch Airport's already been tackling the issue with audio and visual scaring devices and planting special grass to detract the birds. We have the guys who go around themselves in vehicles and using, you know, using whizzes and bangers and star crackers and all sorts of pyrotechnics to scare the birds away. But it's not always a foolproof method. Jet is uh, a real predator, a real threat to the birds. Christchurch Airport is leading the country, being the first to follow overseas methods of using dogs to scare away birds. So we, you know, we see what happens overseas and it works for them and um, we thought let's try it here. So yes, we're the first airport in New Zealand to do this. Helping to keep the issue at bay. Um, I would say it's a big problem, but it's an ongoing problem and, and all airports have them. Birds don't know they're not meant to come here. This wee pup's been chosen because of her placid nature. Out of all the puppies, she was probably one of the brightest, but she is also very tolerant to noise. So I've, I've had her right out close to aircraft now. And she's not perturbed by aircraft noise or, or guns, in fact, uh, firing pyrotechnics or anything. It just doesn't phase her. But being a pup, Jet's still undergoing strict obedience training, needing total recall before heading out to the tarmac. Well, if I tell her to drop, she'll drop if there's any danger um, and I can get her straight back so there's no, no issues for safety. Jet's not going at the job alone, with plans to bring in a second dog to help tackle a hard day's work. Emma Cropper, CTV News.